warm cinnamon apples as an extension to our apple week, okay? So boys and girls, how many of you like apples? Yes, I do too, but they're even better when they're warm with cinnamon. So what you need for to make cinnamon apples is a half teaspoon of vanilla, three tablespoons of melted butter, four and a half teaspoons of cinnamon, two thirds cup of sugar, and six beautiful apples. And you can use red apples, yellow apples, or green apples. Your choice, okay? And then we're gonna prepare them all in an oven. So you can use a little oven like this if you just want a few. Just open it up, it's just a little oven. Or you can use a big oven like this if you guys want to make a whole bunch of apples, say apples for your families, okay? So we're gonna make these together. Okay, right. so boys and girls, you're gonna need a cutting board and with your apples there with you. And then what you're gonna need is you're gonna need a peeler. So you're gonna have to have a find a safe peeler for you to use or maybe your mom or your dad or an adult can help you peel. So what you do is you're gonna peel all six of the apples. And it's really easy to peel. You just go like that, across all the way around. And we're gonna do six whole apples. Once we do six whole apples, we are going to cut them. And we have to make sure we cut them really, really thin. That way they cook faster, all right boys and girls? So once my apple is all peeled, we get rid of all of the red. We don't want any of the red on our apples. We're gonna start slicing them. So what we need is we do need a knife. And you can peel off that stem and just twist it and peel it off and peel the top portion off too. So then boys and girls, you're gonna need a knife. We're gonna make sure you have an adult with you and we're gonna slice these apples so thinly, as thin as possible. Maybe your family has a very, very thin apple slice so they can just do it all at once or you guys can just do it this way okay so we're just going to slice them all up as thin as possible there we go get each side there and then mrs blanche is going to put them all together and we're just going to slice right in half put them all together and slice right in half all right boys and girls and then we're going to put all of these thin apples in your dish all right Okay, so go ahead and do that, and we'll do this together. Okay, so boys and girls, look at this. I peeled all of my apples. So I have my peels and my core. I'm gonna put those to the side because I'm not gonna be using that. No, no, no. And look at this, boys and girls. Look at all of my apples are peeled, and they're sliced so ever thinly. Look at how thin they are, super thin. Boys and girls, don't forget that you're gonna wanna preheat your oven to 350, so we're gonna have to try 350 and we're gonna turn the oven on so that it's on and ready to go. So when we're finished putting everything on top of our apples, we can put them in the oven, all right, boys and girls? Okay, so what we're gonna need is we're gonna need a little bit of vanilla, which is so yummy, for have half a teaspoon of vanilla, right? So we just could pour a little bit in there like this and put it right on top like that. Then we are gonna need the best part that's so yummy, half a teaspoon of vanilla. All right, so, I mean, half a teaspoon of cinnamon. So we're gonna put half a teaspoon of cinnamon on there. Oops, I put a little bit more. It's okay if you put a little bit more if you like a lot of cinnamon. This is when I should put a little bit more than it's asked for. I kind of put double the amount because I love cinnamon. Okay, put the cinnamon on there. All right, so then we need two third cups sugar. So we're gonna put two third cups sugar. Just sprinkle all the way around. Sugar is so yummy. Okay, another cup. All the way around. All right. Then your butter should be melted. So make sure you melt your um, two thirds um, cup of sugar and put it all the way around. Melt it really, really, really good. Excuse me, not the butter. Did I just say sugar? I meant butter. Okay, then we're going to stir it all up to make sure it looks nice and fabulous. So what I use, I just use a fork. I'm going to stir it all in. Make sure all of the apples get the cinnamon and the sugar. And boys and girls, remember, if you like a lot of cinnamon, you can put more cinnamon than they say. All right, I just said that much cinnamon. I doubled it. I might triple it. I'm going to see how brown my apples get. I'm gonna mix it all. Oh my goodness, it smells so yummy. I can't wait to have some apples with cinnamon and sugar on them. I'm mixing it all up. You can help by mixing it with your families. 
Make sure all of it has cinnamon on it, and sugar. Make sure it's, can you see that? Make sure they're all becoming brown with the cinnamon. All right. There we go. There! Yay! Now we have all of them all covered in cinnamon and sugar and butter and vanilla. Then what we're gonna we're gonna do we're gonna cover it with foil. All right. So we cover it with foil, just like that. And when the oven dings, we're gonna put it in the oven. All right. So we'll wait for it to ding to tell us it's ready and nice and hot. Okay. Oh, there it is, boys and girls. It dings. So that means it is ready. So I'm gonna open up the oven. Timer. It's always important to set the timer. So I put my timer on over here for 45 minutes. And we push start. And when that timer dings, we take the apples out and we take off the foil and then we put the apples back in for 10 more minutes, okay? And then it'll be time to eat those yummy, yummy hot apple cinnamon slices, all right? There it is, boys and girls. There's a timer. So we're gonna take the apples out and make sure you put some gloves on. We take the apples out and we are going to take off the foil. Mmm, they smell so good. Maybe we could zoom in on that. Look at their bubbling, boys and girls. They're all bubbling nice and hot. So we'll stick them back in. Oh my goodness, it smells so yummy. And we're going to time her off for 10 more seconds. Okay. I mean, 10 more minutes, excuse me, not 10 more seconds. I wish it was like 10 more seconds. 10 more minutes and we'll see what they, they're like in 10 minutes, all right, boys and girls? All right, boys and girls, we have three more seconds. Two, one, yay, let's turn off that timer and we'll pull out the apples. Oh my goodness, boys and girls, they are so hot and they look so yummy. I can't wait to try them. I'm gonna scoop up some here. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh my goodness, they're so hot. I don't think I could try them yet, but they smell so good. Oh my goodness, boys and girls, I hope you enjoy them as much as I do. Happy Apple Week.